Hi, this is Ross at Woodfire Power, and this is another update on the 4x16 aquaponics system. Um, we are going to be planting some arugula. We took out the lettuce in the front. It was very tasty. There's still a couple of the romaine lettuce. If I look down the length of the table now, you can see that it's green all the way down. Uh, the snow peas are getting taller, and I'll show you those in a minute. The bok choy and chard and kale keep on producing, and we've been harvesting individual leaves off, and we just cut the leaves off for dinner, and then they grow back. The brassicas, uh, the cabbage, and especially the Napa cabbage, are still having problems with aphids, so um, we're probably going to just harvest those. The leaves look great, so just harvest them and wash them off and get that out, but we are going to do a little experiment with some ladybugs and see how well that works. And the broccoli, as I said, is doing great, super tall. Um, chives are here. The beets are also doing great. The onions behind the beets are doing okay, but they're getting shaded, so that didn't work so great. We probably should have turned that around. The lettuce starts, remember this is seed I just put into the gravel rocks about two weeks ago. <clears throat> and they're coming up nicely. So this is going to turn into a whole nother lettuce patch in about, I don't know, maybe two, three weeks we'll be able to start harvesting some baby greens out of here. And let me come around here. <clears throat> I'm just throwing some seed down on the gravel. Little tiny seeds down at the moisture line. And then the, we'll cover it back over again with the gravel. So this is just to get the seed down to where it's um, exposed to the water on every flood cycle. And this is basically what I did two weeks ago with the lettuce. So we're going to see if this works. These are four varieties of arugula. Here's the water coming in from the ponds. And back here we have the snow peas, three different varieties and um, let's see, boy they just really blend in but you can see that we have a bunch of snow peas. These guys should climb six feet tall so they're just getting started and hopefully we'll get a lot of snow peas out of them. Probably could have planted them a little earlier but we did what we did and so that's it. We hope to get the film covering on. Here's a look down the table again and again as I said the hoops are um, two feet above the gravel surface or a little more than that. And so that's that for this update.